Okay, for my review on these speakers, I had them for about a month or so. The R80 version 2 from Personas. What do I think about these? These things is amazing. Now, this review is it's going to be a little bit different from how I do reviews. Or I'll say I've, I've gotten to the point where reviews on speakers... There's no true way of really showing you guys what they sound like. I could put a mic up to them and play away. And I don't know what real observation you guys can gain from me putting a mic to a speaker. I can have tools like some videos, different tools to do like a comparison of this speaker and that speaker. I'll say this. I'll just give you like an overview of what I have and what I've heard and tell you what I think. Right now, I own two pair of Mackies. They are the HR 824s and the 624s. And then, of course, I have the Aris 5. I believe that's what it is. Now, between those, the Aris 5s and these, night and day. Night and day. Obviously, the subwoofer on here is much bigger on here these are eight inches versus the fives you know obviously the tweeters in here are ribbon tweeters and i'm i'm gonna be honest and i'm not saying that because i love personas products or whatever but when i plug these things up i did not have to tune them at all the eris i did i had to like adjust the highs because i felt like it was a little harsh so I turned the highs down a little bit and it was pretty much okay. The difference between the version two and the one, I believe on the back, there is this thing where on the version ones, it was a button that kind of like just dials in the settings or whatever. These don't, everything is touch. You can just adjust, fine tune your adjustments, you know, your knobs as opposed to a button. I just always thought that was weird. Like, what's the button for? I mean, it. I guess during that time, it was kind of cool because there's something that lights up on the back of your speakers. And like, oh, look at that. You know, you can press this button. But, you know, I just think it's better to just be able to, like, fine tune with your finger and find that sweet spot in between, in between, you know, areas just to get that right touch. But I'll say personally for me, listening to these versus the other speakers, um, these sounds amazing. I love them. The bass response is great oh i also have a sub i have the krk um 10 inch sub i don't need a sub with these i don't i really don't the the bass carries really well it's it's punchy yeah it, it's i don't feel like it's a rumble in there and it's just based off my ears me ella you know <laughs> you know um I'm not a professional speaker analyst where I can like tell you exactly the ins and outs and what's, you know what I mean? Because I listen to so many speakers, you know, I know me for me, for what I, what I do, you know, I create urban music, you know, pop, EDM, hip hop, R&B, you know, that's type of stuff, type of stuff I, I do. I do type of stuff, type of music that are played in clubs where there's usually subs there you know what i mean so that's the reason why i have a sub because i need to hear what the club hears and so that's what the sub does for me it, it gives me that bass you know that bass vibe uh the other things that i may be doing is scoring for music where i need you know the, the string the drums that's, that's giving me that epic sound they resonate really well on these speakers i love how these speakers sound and these things can get loud like really loud i had to mess around with them for about a month give me some time to play different type of music do different things on them play some videos play some movies on them uh do some production on them you know what i mean and, and just you know get them to burn in a little bit and i like them i like the design of these it's more sleeker it's clean you know what i mean they they look more professional they they fit well you know yeah I, I i like these a lot now i also can't give you a comparison between the version ones and these because i never owned the, the version ones 
all I know is once I plug these things up, they they were amazing to me. I, I guess giving you guys my credentials might help, but I've been doing music for like 20 plus years. Probably more than that. I've, I've heard several speakers. Yeah, I, I've heard several speakers. Now, these by far, I feel like they're punchy. Definitely. They, yeah. These are these are nice. These are really nice. Now, I think they are a great addition to what I do. And um, <laughs> I, I fell in love with them the first day. I'm going to tell you all what I told my contact person from Personas. You know, I really would love to test them, but I don't know if I want you to send me these because I have a strong feeling that I will like them. And I didn't even ask him the price of them yet because I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared that I, you, you know, I mean, just just send them to me. Just send them to me. I'll, I'll talk about them. And, I, you know, I'll just have them up in my videos. And a lot of you guys have been asking about them. They sound amazing. They sound really amazing. And you know what's funny? I did actually do some videos where I played some beats that I did on Instagram or whatever. And people just heard how great they sound through the phone mic like how is that possible but people was like bro i can hear how clear and the clarity i can hear i could definitely tell that those are very dope speakers just by what i did with the the video that i upload on instagram and i was like wow that's amazing that's really amazing because um well i will say the other speakers like, like i say there's night and day when I do stuff like that, it was always with the smaller speakers. Those don't do as much as these, obviously, but, you know, I don't know. You know, the, they even resonate well over video from your iPhone. So, you know, yeah, yeah, these, these are pretty dope. And I'll, I'll say like the, um, the weight of them, it's not that heavy. I thought it was gonna be heavy. When I opened the box up, I just knew they was gonna be heavy. These are not that heavy. I don't know what type of wood this is, but they, they're they pretty light for the size. I was impressed, yeah, but they sound really good. So of course, if this is something you're interested in, there's affiliate link to where you can purchase these speakers. And maybe there's other videos where people do a better job showing you guys what they, sound like versus other speakers i'm just giving you my take on what i think about them i really like them and i really hope to to be able to keep them so hello creative sound creative university signing off remember music is art you're the artist paint your picture stay creative without rules